quick comparison of the Nick Giga 10 gigabit PCIe Ethernet card. This one has the Marvel AQtion AQC 113C chipset in here, capable of doing 10 gigabit per second, 5 gigabit per second, 2.5 gigabit per second, 1 gigabit per second, and 100 megabits per second. Very easy to connect to older protocols and slower protocols as well. This is the Nick Giga card, and this is a new one I just got. This is the card I'm actually comparing it to. This one is the Intel X540 T1. This one is an Intel card right here. It's the Intel X540 T1 card, and this is a solid card. The limitation with this card is that it's either 10 gigabit, 1 gigabit, or 100 megabits. There's no 5 gigabit or 2.5. For some reason, this card just keeps disabling itself under Windows 10, and sometimes I lose my IP address and I have to restart my computer every once in a while. So this is what I've had, and this is what I'm upgrading to. This is the Nick Giga 10 gigabit PCIe card with the Marvel AQC 113C controller. So we're gonna go ahead and use this card instead. This one has a more modern chipset. It's more compatible. It's got Windows 10 and Windows 11 drivers right out of the box. RJ45 jack, just like this one. They're both RJ45 jacks. 10 gigabit ethernet card. That's what it looks like right here. Nick Giga 10 gigabit PCIe network card.